One, two steps at a time. Close your eyes, take your time. Feel the wind, feel the high jump. Personally, mahirap siya kasi madami sila and onti na lang yung, ano, onti na lang yung time. So, pero as the time goes by, na kakaroon kami ng bonding and na masay nagiging nagkakaroon kami ng relationship din and masaya. What was your inspiration in creating the collateral or posters for this place? So, first yung inspiration ko is the script. As in, uh, pinasa ko muna siya para din naman ako makakuha ng parang theme such as yung scenes dun sa script. Dun yung, yun yung ginawa kong inspiration. And then after that, um, kinonect ko lang yung parang naisip kong color palette which is orange, brown, and such para ang cop siya dun sa title ng play. And then, dun naman sa mga uh, individual posters, Um, tumingin lang ako sa mga more on historical since, ayun, yun yung parang nakikita kong theme sa play and yun, ang home siya dun. The question is, what is the process of your team with regards to picking the costume and having different looks of the character? Um, since kasi nagsimula ang lahat sa script, so dun kami, nagkaroon kami ng session sa team namin na Aralin yung script bago kami magsimula sa lahat. Then, research process. Nag-search kami ng matinde, buong team, and after that. Yeah, we made sure na every character had um, their personality dun sa para sila manamin. It showed their um, characters, their difference, their individuality. So, that's, what, that's the process of how we made the costumes for the cast. How did your team come up with a technical arrangement for this production? Yeah, so, because we have trust in each other, in our team, there are different tasks for us, and that's it. We just collaborated after our research and in our own part. And it was smooth because we knew what we were going to do. And we were able to excel in our previous projects. So, can you please explain the process? Process ng ano po? <laughs> ah, siguro yung ano, yung talagang pinag-aralan namin yung script, sinang puso namin, gano'n. <laughs> As part of the alumni community, what is the most challenging part in designing the set of this production? Um, yung coordination na lang rin siguro sa ibang Uh, sa students and then sa ibang alumni then for ano communication and then um, siguro yung uh, um, budget na lang na rin sa ano, sa production and then um, oras kasi kailangan mo talaga magbigay ng oras para sa production natin. How is the transition from being a cast to a stage manager? Uh, personally, it was hard for me because 
before, all of my focus was on the roles that I got. But um, transitioning towards this role, which is the stage manager, mahirap pala siya. Um, I thought it was easy, because basically they were just they were just you know putting marks on the stage, adjusting people. Pero no ako ni nando. Tatik kami yung nalilate, kasi kaya kami nagtatag. Bakit late? Okay. Pero pala yon. For me naman it was ano, it was fun, kasi mas na appreciate ko yung prod ng nagkita ko siya ng isang buong. Kasi no cast ako parang yung sarili ko lang eh. Yes. Parang yung mga ko actors lang ngayon parang kailangan intindihin ko yung intindihin nate na tatag po yung buong prod. Kaya kailangan tumatag po yung prod, kasi kasalanan namin kapag hindi. <laughs> so holistically, we can say na it amazing. was an amazing experience to be both part of the cast and the production team. Yeah. Um, what are your significant experiences uh, working with the production? Working with the production, it is actually learning from them as well as I teach them something. It's like an exchange of knowledge and experiences, which I really enjoy because I love learning and also I love teaching. I think that is the most significant uh, experience in being part of a production. Give us a reaction. Oh my god, wow, really? <laughs> so, Adonis and Reggie, can you please describe your play? Uh, for me, the play is significant. Yes, Reggie. Yung sa akin, the play is wonderful. <laughs> And for me, then, po ang the play is very historical, po and yun. And Wilbur and Kurt, bakit dapat abangan to ng mga manonood? So, bakit kailangan abangan ng mga manonood? Kasi since yung sabi ng energy na very historical siya, and marami kang mapupul na araw di na parang nagiging interconnected yung about sa history nga um, from the past and present. Uh, it is important to to reflect ourselves into the past history. Uh, kaya ang abangan nyo ngayon is hindi lang yung napapanahon kundi yung past history din. Hi Cass! Hi! So, kumusta makatrabaho ang iyong co-cast sa production na to? And what is your favorite line sa film? Um, masaya. Sobrang saya kasi hindi ito yung first time na yung mag-work pero ito yung first time na connected yung mga characters namin. Kaya sobrang saya. Kasi sobrang saya talaga eh. Wait lang ulit ako. <laughs> Super saya. Kahit ito yung first time na yung mag-work na connected yung mga characters namin. Nagkakaroon kami ng bonding. Tapos after rehearsal, nag-aaral kami ng script. Tapos pagdating sa mismo rehearsal, hindi namin memories yung script. <laughs> Pero kahit ganun, part ng process. Kaya mas lalo kami pinapatibay yung relationship namin together para magampanan yung mga roles na ipepresent namin sa inyo. Favorite line, lul lulot at sinasakit na lipunan. How about you, Kyle? Um, ano, um, mas maganda experience to na nakasama ko sila nila. Kasi um, kahit nagkasama na kami before, uh, iba pa din kasi yung ngayon. Kasi kami tatlo lang yung cast. And then, um, uh, dami ko natutunan sa kanila ng dalawa. Especially during the process of preparation. Kasi uh, bukod sa may nakilala akong uh, dalawang bagong kaibigan, uh, nakilala ko, nas, may, marami ako natutunan sa characters nila na ako din personally, babaunin ko din sa aking personal life. And uh, ayun, I'm excited na makita din ng mga mananood yung pinarepare namin na kahit sa sandaling panahon lang kami nag-rehearse, alam ko na talagang hindi lang kami, but the whole team, uh, binigay talaga nila yung lahat-lahat nila just to put this up. So, um, big favorite line, pagod na ako. <laughs> How about you? Um, me. <laughs> I'm really grateful having them at my back. <laughs> Like, hindi namin, like there are times sa rehearsal na we don't know the, 
uh, lives of each other, pero nandiyan sila to, ano, to support talaga. And I'm confident and I believe na kaya namin to. Yes! <laughs> and my favorite line is, P.S. Mukhang liwewan. Hi, Kenneth. So, yung tanong is, ano yun sa tingin mong pinagkaiba ng mga nagawa mong pantanong ngayon kung para sa mga noon? Siguro yung pagkakaiba noon kasi uh, more on English kami. And ito ay pangatlo namin play na Tagalog. Isa rin siguro sa mga pinag... Mas challenging siya, of course. Pero isa sa pinaka... Uh, pinagkaiba ng ngayon sa noon is yung noon, humugot ako ng inspirasyon sa iba. Pero yung ngayon, humugot ako ng inspirasyon sa akin. Sa mga experience ko. So, malapit sa puso ko itong play na to. Kaya, yun. Yun yung pagkakaiba ng noon at sa ngayon. What is your experience working with a cast and a production in this play? And what do you want the audience to pick up after nila mapanood yung play? Okay. Um, this set of cast and production team very ano sila very varied. May mga bago, may mga luma. But uh, the challenges will always be there on handling people, especially in knowing whether they are good at this or good at that, or whether they will be working uh, much better if dito yung binigyan natin trabaho. Pero the key thing with working with people is we need to know their strength. Aside from that, is that we need to know kung saan sila mas masaya. Kasi it's happy working with happy people. Lagi yung lagi natin tandaan na kailangan we need to keep our uh, temper cool kaya na sobrang pressure na. Like, for this, we are working only for almost a month for this production. Pero, na-push through siya, napapalo niyo ito ngayon. So, this is a work of miracle. This is a magic. This is something that these people na pinagpaguran to. And I can say that more than miracle and magic, this is hard work. And what people should expect from this is that hindi natin kailangang bumalik sa nakaraan para malaman natin kung ano ang mga araw ng kasaysayan. Sabi nga ni uh, Makario, ang kasaysayan na hindi lamang pagsasaulo ng mga bagay na nangyari sa nakaraan, ngunit ito rin ay pagsasapuso ng mga bagay na may saysay upang magamit natin sa kinabukasan. No to historical revisionism. Kailangan stand yung, malakas yung stand natin, firm tayo, na sasabihin natin, ano ang mga naganap sa kasaysayan na kailangan hindi na, 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 kailangan hindi na maulit. Muli, tayo si Lucas, tayo ang bukas.
Hang puso ko'y dinudulog sa'yo Nagpapagong magbahal Nagsusumamo Pagkinapatin mo Ikaw ay mamastal Makalikan Sa'yo ay pumisan Ang puso ko'y dinudulog sa'yo Welcome to our virtual celebration of JRU 103rd Founding Anniversary. I would like to start by wishing you and your families all the best for your health and safety in these difficult times. I would li also like to express my profound gratitude to all who are part of the preparation for this week-long event, who work hard and selflessly, to come out with these exciting presentations and activities. From day one, our opening day, up to day seven, our virtual alumni gathering. To our ever supportive president, Dr. Vincent K. Fabella, fellow officers, parents, resilience, ladies and gentlemen, a pleasant evening. We are celebrating the 103rd founding anniversary of our university with the theme JRU 103, Making a Difference Through Excellence, Agility, and Resilience. We are already on our second year of facing and braving the COVID-19 pandemic. We have our own shares and struggles, but I know that one thing is for sure, that indeed we are alive and blessed to still be here to witness this historic event in our dear university. Once again, sit back and enjoy the College Division's evening presentation. This is Chatra Rizal's Kayumanggi, Ang Kulay ng Araw. Hi, good evening, and welcome to JRU at 103. Tonight is the much-awaited and anticipated college presentation a play entitled, an original play entitled, Kayumanggi Ang Kulay ng Araw. This is a historical fiction musical by E.J. Villafania, Kenneth Dael, and Leo Mansilungan about the magic of sunset. The main theme of the story is to encourage the audience to look at history as one of our bases for making intelligent and crucial decisions. It's a subtle commentary on historical revisionism and the dangers of not putting the importance of the lessons of history into our own thinking. This brings to mind really the quote from uh, the British Prime Minister Winston Churchill, who in 1948 said, those who do not learn from history are doomed to repeat it, to repeat its harsh lessons. And that's what we want to avoid. Kayumanggi Ang Kulay ng Araw is part of the National Commission for Culture and Arts National Arts Month 2022 celebration, Sining ng Pag-asa under the National Committee on Dramatic Arts. The event was originally spearheaded by the Teatro Rizal alumni community, together with the NCCA, the Department of Tourism National Parks Development Committee, 
and the Mandaluyong Arts Council. To give honor to their alma mater, the Teatro Rizal alumni invited the current cast members to be part of the cast of the said musical. I want you all to enjoy the musical tonight. Uh, we take pride in Teatro Rizal. They've done excellent, excellent, and creative work in the past. I'm sure tonight will be no different. Enjoy and mabuhay Rizal. Ang lahat ng bumabagabag 
dalapag ay naging banaya na ba patungo sa paglaya na hindi naduduwag.
Oh 
Isang araw ay sabi mo rin pangalan mo. At sila ko na parang tuulan. Halos tanghali na. Huling-huling pa rin. Naisip ko tuloy paano yung mga iba na wala namang maayos yung tinagawin mo umulan. Paano yung mga magsasaka na pwedeng mabaha? Hindi ko pwedeng sabihin ng aking pangalan. Delikado na. Sorry. Ewan. Ewan, wala akong malayong investment sa langit ngayon. Hindi ko nga napansin na makulimlim kanina umago, kanina tangali. Paano ba naman buong araw ako nasa hospital? Pero, ayos na kung nahihiya ka. Ako nga pala si Lucas. Lucas? Nakakaibig naman ko yung ngalan. Pwede naman siguro kahit sa mga liham ay ikaw ang aking magkibigan. Turuan mo ako paano gamitin na recorder na ito. Para... Maraming mo rin ang boses ko. Anong Lucas? Hindi Lucas ang pangalan ko ah. Sige, ang tawag sa akin ng mga kaibigan ko, Makario. Turuan mo kong gamitin ang recorder. Thank you. 
gagawin ko na agad ah, 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 Inaangkin nila ito! Elisa... Elisa Lucas... Karin... Ano ito na library day day 1972 pa? I'm gonna 
Kailan ko pwede ipapa yung mga ko? Pero tandaan mo ito, huwag mo ahala na kasaysayan. 
Kasi sa isaya, hindi na pagsasaulo ng mga kaganapan ng mga At kundi pagsasapuso ng mga sa isaya na pwede mo magamit sa ibang bukasan. Huwag mong hahayaan mabago ang kasaysaya. Lumas! Tulaan mo ito. Kasi kaling ko kung anong aming kapalanan. Kitaan mo ako sa paang tuwing kayo maghinaan. Sa mga susunod na panahon. Pumakao! Pumakao! Thank <laughs> you. 
na damay mga piti ay nagsisimula na rin iwan na Let's go. 
Bye, Abba. 
Yun. 103rd founding, founding anniversary of Sarasota University. University. Second, we would like to thank everyone for giving us your precious time to watch our evening presentation entitled Kayo Mangi Ang Kulay ng Araw. We face a lot of struggles during the pandemic which includes transitioning performances from face to face to virtual. We are grateful to have been given this opportunity to perform once again and we can say it's a balik tanghalan for us. In line with this amazing opportunity, we would like to thank those people and organizations who made this impossible to possible. Masarizal University and our president, Dr. Vicente K. Fabella, Dr. Annabelle Cayugan, the director of Student Development Office, Miss Miss Ivory Malinao, director of marketing and communication, and the University Cayug. University Way Committee, especially, especially JC Chong, eh, Mr. JC Chong, and alumni community, alumni community for supporting us from the very beginning of our journey. We would like to thank also the following organizations: Mandaluyong Arts Council, National Commission for Culture and Arts, and UP Dramatista. We wouldn't be able to do this without all your overwhelming support. And also, our major sponsor, Skincare Bad Vanilla. <laughs> to all the cast, ensemble, creative director, music, playwright, stage manager. <laughs> Technical team. Technical team. Let us all keep in this mind sa takip silim, may darating na pagong pag-asa. And now that we open our curtains again, we make sure that our tagline, Passion for Art, Art for Passion, will be our DNA as an artist. So for aspirants, members, officers, and our beloved and fogging advisor, we just want to congratulate you all and thank you. Alumni who really help us and support us, so even though they have other responsibilities, they were able to help us in our production successfully. So we really appreciate you all, Ates and Kuya. Happy 100th birthday! 